Hello viewers, this is IT system admin, a complete troubleshooting solution for you. Today, in this tutorial, I am going to show you how to fix Windows 10 stop code error 0xc000021. Sometimes it becomes very important for you, so don't forget to watch full video. This error code will not let you enter the computer. If you want to get into your computer again without installing a new operating system, then we have to reset this PC to keep my files options. It is an easy process to fix this stop code error 0xc000021a permanently. Now I am going to show you how to fix this issue. The simply, the first way to solve this issue is to restart your computer. You just restart your computer and uh, this problem may be solved. And next option is just unplug all external devices and restart your PC. This solution also solved your issues but most of the case will still persist now i'm going to show you how to fix this issue easily just connect your usb bootable drive to your computer and then restart your computer now boot your computer from usb plus drive in language section just Click on next. Now you will find a link that is repair your computer. Just click on repair your computer. Now you will get three options. One continue, then troubleshoot and then turn off your PC. Just click on troubleshoot. Now click on command prompt. Command prompt has been opened. Now in command prompt, type SFC space slash scan now. Now this process will scan all your system files and it will recover the corrupted system files. Now just hit enter. Verification process has been started. Verification 100% complete. Windows resource protection did not find any integrity violation. Okay, now close command prompt. Now click on continue. And this process will restart your computer. Hope your problem has been solved right now. If your problem is still persist, again, boot from USB bootable drive, and then click on next, and then click on repair. Click on troubleshoot, click on command prompt, and I am going to Enlarge the size of command prompt. Right click on title bar and click on properties and click on font. And I'm going to select 24 size and the font size has been increased. Okay, now you have to find your operating system drive now. Type C clone and hit enter. Look, command prompt has been entered into C drive. Now type DIR to look for operating system files. Look, there is no operating system files are existing here. 
Okay. Now type D clone and hit enter. Now type DIR and hit enter. Look, all operating systems files such as program files, program files, x86, users, windows, all are existing here. That means your operating system files are existing in D drive. Okay, now I have to run a command that is type the command csk for check, dsk for disk, space slash f space slash r now hit enter now click y for would you like to force a this amount on this volume type y and hit enter the process is continuing uh, it will check all your disk drive and it will fix the disk drive all five stages of this take has been finished. Now you need to restart your computer. So close command prompt. Now click on continue. After restarting your computer, your computer will again enter into recovery mode. Now click on see advanced repair options. Now click on troubleshoot. Again click on advanced option. Now click on command prompt. Type D and clone, then hit enter. I'm maximizing the size of command prompt. so that you can easily understand type dism space slash image clone d for d drive as because my operating system files are located in d drive again clone then backslash space slash cleanup hyphen image space slash revert pending actions revert pending actions now hit enter deployment image servicing and management tool has successfully complete the operation close common prompt now click on continue Now I am logging to my computer. Look, the error code 0xC000021A has been solved right now. This is all for today. Hope this tutorial is helpful for you. Keep watching for next tutorial. Thank you very much.